Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon, ladies and gents, and welcome back to AS2. Welcome back to the editor, and welcome back to the Great War Realism mod. Today, we are playing as the French against the Austro-Hungarian Empire, and uh, we are attacking the Fort de Vox. Now, for me, this looks like it's in the... Um, Kind of uh, the Dun style territory. We have a fairly hard fight against ourselves, up against well, up against the enemy today. Uh, but I think I think we can just about make it. I think we can just about do it. So we got some friendly infantry, and we got some uh, we got some friendly infantry attacking, and we have some of our own infantry that hopefully. I can uh, push up in the meantime and kind of get rid of these outer conclaves of infantry. We should have to be keep our eyes on this guy up here. Perfect. Okay, so we have two guys left, that's absolutely fine. Let's run them along this trench line. And let's capture the other flags. Damn right, we have. Ah, god damn it. <laughs> that is causing havoc, right. Let's see if we can't bring in a Mortius, that would be lovely. 275. We have a bit of a way to go. Alright. Our frontal charge has kind of run out of steam. I'm hoping that we will get another one in. Because we can't, like... In World War One, you can't just move forward by like one squad at a time. You're going to get absolutely decimated. Now, this do an enemy here. Yeah, they didn't really attack very much on the right hand flank. It was only on the left hand flank that they really removed any presence. They're still kind of going as well. well ladies and gents, we have reinforcements. We have a second wave coming in, and it looks like the uh, Austro-Hungarians have sent a little bit of a uh, attempt at a counter attack. I'm hoping that through this attack, oh, they look like ants, don't they? I'm hoping that through this attack, I can move up my right flank and take out this. Because we can nearly, we can nearly afford this, uh, this mortar, which is going to help out a lot. Oh, we have an MG on this side as well. Oh, bollocks. Right, okay, no. Um, come over here. Well, those guys are distracted. Oh! Holy crap, I just... Oh, no, I thought I lost, like, my entire section of infantry then just because of a more massive uh, artillery strike. That could have been nasty. Come on, yes, they're falling back. They're falling back. Get them. Right, let's bring in our mortar. Take him out. Okay, you can't aim that far. Okay, no worries, no worries, no worries, no worries. Um. Oh Christ, there's MGs. In oh my God. Oh okay. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. Okay, we're gonna have to take this steady. Get down in here, gents. Get down in here. We are gonna have to take this very, very steadily. Oh, 
Oh, is the MG gone? Yes, the MG's gone. Okay, okay, we're all good. We're all good. We're all good. Okay, let's go and take this right hand side and then we can concentrate on the fort. Where's my mortar? I want you to sit right here. And blast away. Yes, 90 MP at once. Wonderful. Right. Move over to the right flank. Capture this objective as well. Come on, gents. We've got the momentum now. Hold it. Yes. Right, so let's get these. Uh, let's get these. Oh, hello. Oh, damn. Oh, we've got another line. Oh, it's awesome. We've got another line of infantry coming in. Uh, where's that mortar? Where's the mortar ended up? So, the mortar got stuck behind a sandbag because wonderful pathfinding. You can. Is there an MG to piece up here? There is, right. You can hop on that. Oh my god, mate. They are getting absolutely trash coming over that hilltop. By that MG. Holy crap. That's a really nasty position, MG. Um, I don't know where the really the pressure points on here this are. Why don't you Why don't you climb up that ladder? Why don't you do that? Huh? Go and climb up that ladder. There you go. We can probably afford another one. Yeah, we can. Oh, the light guns. Wait, they look like... No, they're direct fire. I don't want them. I want IDF. I want indirect fire guns. I do not want direct fire. Direct fire is going to only cause me problems. Oh! He took that on the head. Yes, good, good job, gents. Good job. Good bloody job. Right. You guys, come up that. Get up on the top there. We are making good, really, really good movements here. Right, so we're doing damn good. Yes, we've got another mortar set up. Wonderful. We might actually be able to move that up onto the uh, top of the castle pretty damn soon. Let's get some uh, let's get some more infantry in so that we can take this flag. Oh dear, they're doing okay. They're doing guys, gents. They're doing a counter attack. <gasps> damn son, that trashed us. Right, gents, form up, form up, form up, form up. There's no more of you. <sighs> okay, we need to... We need to get guys on guns. We lost all of them. Oh, damn. That is not good. Um, we can make them do an okay job up there. Shit. They're going to get wiped out as well, aren't they? Bugger.
We need to like almost sit in energy up here. Let's get some heavy machine guns out and about. Oh wow, they just took a big hit from an artillery piece. I don't know whether that was mine or theirs. But they are doing a pretty solid counterattack. This is actually quite dangerous for us now. Right, so our mortars are doing a damn good job, but we actually need to pull them back. Damn it, we lost one of them. Bollocks. Okay, we need infantry. We're actually losing this. We're actually losing now because of this counter attack. Oh, damn. Oh, nice. We're doing a counter counter. Ah, I like it. Where are my gents? Here they are. We're countering their counter that's countering my original attack. I like it. <laughs> The question is, who the hell is going to win? I don't think they can shoot that high, can they? No, oh, no, they can. Good job. Right. Gents, we're going to go on a stealth mission. I'm guessing these MGs are down. Nope, he's still not down. Oh, Christ. That one is, though. Okay, yeah, we're going on a stealth mission. Gonna climb up here. Ladder. Oh, we got grenaded to hell. Oh, no, the ladder's gone. Bollocks. Yes. Good job, gents. Okay, that MG is now down. Wonderful. I want you to come up here and bollocks, you can't do that, okay. Uh, go up there. You boys, come and stand on that. That centre pattern, guys, is an utter, utter kill zone. You need to get the hell out of there, right? Bring some more infantry and we'll man these mortars again. Sit up there, right there, right there, right there, gents, right there. Get them in the crossfire. That's how you do it, boys. Good job. Bloody good job. Right, let's consolidate this position. Let's get some gents on the walls. Oh. Okay, there's quite a long line in there. Okay. Okay. Right, in that case, let's get some uh, let's get some firepower in here. Right, so I think if we can get a uh, if we can get a steady baseline on uh, on this fort, we should be able to hold off most attacks. Um, I oh hello, right, let's get you inside here. Put you on that wall.
That MG is still up and it's causing a massive issue for us. Hopefully, some of this infantry will uh, will take that MG out, I'm hoping. I do not have room for cowards on my battlefield, gentlemen. Will someone take out this goddamn machine gun? Seriously, you're standing right next to it. You are standing right next to it. Shoot them. Really? Hey, there we go. Now it's down. Not that I didn't try hard enough, it's just the AI is screwing itself over. Right. Let's capture this flag. And then we only have, what, four more to go? Oh, Christ. <laughs> right, we're actually moving forward so fast now that our artillery can't actually keep up with the pace we're going at. Right, we're actually... <laughs> We've actually done really, really well, really, really quickly. Yeah. I think it's just the last few bunker machine guns that we've got to take in this area. So I've realised quite a key issue of why my uh, mortars aren't firing is that they've all but one of them has run out of ammo. <laughs> Which doesn't help the situation. But we only have three more objectives to capture. And then we have won the day. We have more to support helping out our friendly infantry that's pushing in. I think we're going to do this. Yes, we have. Oh, we've got another few guys coming in. It's just this MG we're going to take out. Gents, can you just please, like, grenade it maybe? Thank you. Someone's clever. Really? Really? Are you having a bubble? There we go. Right. Right. I will send you two guys off to there to capture that. And then you chappies can defeat these guys. So, ladies and gents, in the final closing stages of this battle, we're on our last objective. The enemy are trying to do little tiny counter-attacks here and there, but they're really not having very much effect at all. I wonder how many people we lost on both sides. Damn! 826 friendly losses to 315 enemy losses. That would probably be our first two attacks that we did without any mortar support. That was a big blast that just came in there. That was a hell of a big blast that just came in there. Christ. So yes, ladies and gents, the Fort de Vox is now ours. We will fortify it and hope that the enemy doesn't have anything to bring back at us. But, uh, yeah. If you did enjoy that video, please let me know down in the comments because that was, that video was not scripted at all. This mission is not scripted. I found it on the Steam Workshop and I made some edits to it. That is it. So if you did enjoy this style of video, then please do let me know down in the comments because I will do more of them. I have an awesome, awesome video on the way from uh, the one and only Mr. Coral Rooster, something he has been working on for a long, long time. We also have some upgrades coming to the interwar mod. And hopefully when Dan Danny Strategist uh, gets onto his holiday and out of college work, then he will be able to update some of his mods and campaigns as well. The, uh, the Modern Warfare Battle of Donbass or War of Donbass um, campaign is still in the creational phase, but will be up within the next couple of weeks. And we are back in full swing to our World War One campaign. As always, ladies and gents, thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for your support. And I will see you on the battlefield.